Police in Harrisburg are responding to an uptick in violence. Now they plan to have an increased presence through the weekend and into next week. Fox 43's Grace Griffithson has more on the latest crimes, plus how neighbors are responding. I'm just really tired. I'm tired of the young boys' violence. You know what I mean? One of the latest acts of violence in Harrisburg has longtime resident Don Archer saying, Enough is enough. Police found a 17 year old shot dead near Archer's house on North 5th Street last night. At this time, few details on the shooting have been released. I was sitting on my porch. What did you see or hear? I didn't see a nothing. I was sitting on my porch. All, only, the only thing I seen that the street was blocked off. Her thoughts? I'm not going up there. There's too many cops. And I ain't trying to run into no gunfire. At least there was like five cars, five cop cars. The whole team was covered with the yellow tape. A memorial for the teen who friends and family call Tim Tim. It's really shocking because I lived here for a year and nothing happened. Yeah, it was a, a tragic loss of life. It's not the only crime in the city. Last weekend, three shootings on three different streets injured three people. Mayor Eric Pappenfuss addressing the gun violence in a live discussion this afternoon. And unfortunately, it is representative of, uh, you know, a, a larger uptick in violence that we're seeing. Pappenfuss is proposing 12 new paid positions for Harrisburg police, community service aides, or civilians that will work alongside officers to engage with community members, assist police with some calls, and help with report writing. Really, people who have a willing heart to serve, that want to do good in the community. These positions must first be approved by city council. In total, if approved, the city would be spending more than $1 million annually for community policing. Now, these positions must first be approved by Harrisburg City Council. If approved, the city would be spending more than $1 million annually on community policing. In Harrisburg, Grace Griffithen, Fox 43 News.